next guest played my wife on All My Children, and she's now breaking new hearts on Young and the Restless, soon to be seen in her very first Hallmark movie, Holiday for Heroes. Welcome back, my very, very good friend and ex-wife on television. Anyway, <laughs> Melissa Claregan. Welcome, Missy. Love for that you're having me. It's so good to be here. Yes, uh, this is exciting for it's many very reasons. Exciting. We're friends, but like I mentioned, we were you married. married. All my children. It's the whole I thing. Played Ryan. Mm -hmm. You played Annie. Annie. But our relationship on the soap, well, it wasn't super Hallmark it, friendly. It was not. It took a couple turns. Yeah. Um, I believe uh, you were my first TV husband. Yeah. You know, oh, that's a big, big deal. deal. It was a big deal. You're her, his now TV wife. Well, you know what thank this is you. like. I I'm feeling a little left <laughs> out here. I'm a little bit like, You're included. You know, and then I'm what the happened? You suffered a head injury and yeah. I forgot who I was. Yeah. Yeah, I got, you know, my head hurt, and then all of a sudden I didn't recognize. We spent a lot of time wow. in the hospitals. We did. There's Missy in, a, in the hospital bed, and then there's, I was in the hospital. Yeah. And, and people it doesn't happen here. People ask me, what were you in the hospital for that time in that photo? And I'm like, oh my, I was yeah, in the hospital 17,000 times. Well, and I think the, the best part was you, for, in that storyline, you remembered everyone else in town except me. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so awful. So I, I was really like a girl. Why am I laughing? Uh, that's horrible. And then you fell in love with your ex, your ex wife came back into town, and you fell in love with her. And so that's then I, true. So then I, I, I tried to kill her like four times. Uh, wow. It's a soap opera, you know. Wow. Cameron. I didn't succeed, I will But, say. you know, you also ended up in an insane asylum. I well. went to the mental institution. So there was a lot going on. Yeah. I love these storylines. Just your average yeah. week. Well, yeah. so interesting. This happens in every town across America. Yeah. I mean, as far as I'm concerned. Yeah. All right, so now you're back <laughs> as Chelsea. Yes. On Young and the Restless after yes. a year away. And, and much like your character on All My Children, you are right smack dab in the middle of a very wild love triangle. Tell us what's yes. going on. Um, well, Chelsea is, um, you know, torn between two loves right now, these brothers, Adam and Nick. Um, Adam, she thought, had died in this explosion uh, a couple years ago, but now he's back, he's alive. And head, he's does he have head trauma He well? No head trauma. Okay. He actually remembers me. Does he? <laughs> well, that's a good sign. <laughs> it is always Way a good go. sign. I'm um, excited for Chelsea. Yeah, so, but she fell in love with Nick yeah. um, when she thought Adam had passed on. Oh. So um, Adam's back, but he kind of has gone to the dark side. Yeah. He's kind of just doing really bad things. So she's kind of more on, you know, the Nick train, if you yeah. will, for now. But then she always has these underlying things for Adam. It's hard, girl. And what's it's the hard. father it's of her child? I know. What is she supposed and to do? Great actors playing both yeah. of these characters. Uh, obviously, Joshua Moore, who I've known for years and yes. years, plays Nick Newman. And uh, the, the character of Adam is such a great character for you to be playing opposite of. Yeah. But the fans, like Hallmark fans out there, I know you guys are so loyal and devoted, have come up with kind of names, depending on which, oh, yeah. you know, who they're rooting for, because <laughs> oh, yeah. you know they're rooting for, you know, they some for Nick, some for Adam. Yeah, oh. especially like on Twitter. So it's, you know, Chelsea and Adam is Chatham, <laughs> and oh, like Chelsea it. and Nick is Chick. So, oh. um, I don't know, did we have one? I wanted to I ask you, you, I thought for sure you would remember, Ryani? It was Ryani, it, it was, was Ryani. Not Rihanna? Well, I, I, let's go with Rihanna. Rihanna. Rihanna was on All My Children. Rihanna. <laughs> Rihanna was on. Oh, Riri. We'll call you Riri, just okay. like Rihanna calls okay. herself. Back I like us having Riri. I remember yeah. uh, yeah. Annie now. Okay. Now you sorry. remember. <laughs> the head trauma has passed. It's since passed. You now remember. <laughs> we had so much fun. <laughs> Melissa, we talked a little bit earlier about your love for animals and mm -hmm. rescue when you were um, at the top of the show with Larissa. Yes. Will you tell us about all the great work you're doing with Dharma? Sure. So Dharma Rescue, we actually were here a few years ago and yeah. brought the doggies in their wheelchairs. Basically, these two women are incredible and they rescue these dogs that are um, pretty much on death's door. Um, they've been disabled, they've been hit by cars and given up for adoption and they rescue them and fit them for wheelchairs and uh, train them to be therapy dogs. So they go into schools, um, they used to do hospitals and airports as well um, and they're just happy as can be these dogs and they just inspire children. Um, they've gone into schools oh. for children with autism, um, for all different kinds of things. Oh. And uh, these two women are amazing. I would say there's like a special place in heaven for them. So mm -hmm. it's dharmarescue.org. I just try to make them as much money as possible because the vet bills and the, and the wheelchairs are $500 each, yeah, customized expensive. for each yes. dog. Yeah. Um, the surgeries, everything. So. You raise money for them, but you also raise awareness. I mean, I know you're getting the word out on your Instagram yeah, and yeah, things. Yeah. You should do great work. Thank you for sure everything you're doing. Yeah, really, you guys. Now we got to talk about Holiday for Heroes, uh, Hallmark Christmas movie. We're so excited about this. I was excited. We're now back in the same family again, which is very. Oh, very wait a minute! I see uh -oh. maybe a future movie where you two could actually be husband and wife again. I'm just saying. I'm maybe just no saying. head trauma. Maybe that's Annie. I will. That's I like promise you, if that happens, I'll remember you amazing. all the way through the entire movie. You won't fall in love with your ex-wife. No, I promise. No, that. sure. That will not happen. <laughs> be in the storyline. You better not, Mister. This movie looks really sweet, and it's also yeah. got a great message of, mm -hmm. of love uh, and acceptance yeah. as well. Tell us about yeah, it. Yeah, I'm so excited. This was my first Hallmark project. I had a blast. It was one of the best 
professional experiences I ever had. Um, we shot it in Connecticut. It's a beautiful, you know, love story, but it also, um, uh, my brother and Mark Lucas, who plays my love interest, if you will, are both in the military and they're abroad serving our country. And it just deals with a lot of the issues of how they give up so much to, mm. you know, fight right. for us and our and serve our country. And they miss holidays. They miss right. holidays at Christmas. And it's heartbreaking for them and for their families. So they really address a lot of that in this movie, which I thought was special on top of the really beautiful, sweet love story. It was, it's just really, I'm really excited for everybody to it's see it. Really it's really touching. It's a really movie. Yeah, it is very touching. I'm married yes. to a veteran, so oh, I understand okay. that all yes. too well. Yes. I know, yes. yeah, it's a real yeah. thing. Well, we have a clip where okay. your character Audrey and Matt fall in love for oh. the first time. Let's okay. take a look. Dear First Sergeant Evans, I'm so happy you like the coffee. When it comes to Christmas spirit, I operate at a 10. I try to stretch out the season as best I can, but by February, I already miss it. I don't want you to have to ration your coffee, so as long as you promise to celebrate Christmas every month, I promise to keep sending more. Take care, Audrey. I'm doing my best to keep up my end of the bargain here. This month I celebrated by gift giving. Red Barn Coffee went with me into a village today and helped me make a few new friends. Let's just say your coffee is an international success. You may want to prepare for some more orders. Your caffeinated pen pal, Matt. Coffee as a care package. I send my brother coffee and he shares it with Sergeant Matt Evans, um, played by Mark Lucas, who's amazing. And then he sends me a thank you note as um, you know the gentleman that he is. And then I write him a note back and we just start this 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 oh pen pal gosh. thing. And so. that's where the love story really begins. That's, where it begins. that's a beautiful way to start a love story. It, 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 you really get I mean, to know happens. each other for real exactly. that way. Exactly. Paper exactly. and a pen. Imagine that. that. Whoa, what? I'm <laughs> sorry, I don't recognize those words anymore. <laughs> if everyone's texting you. It's true. It's true. Missy, it's true. Congratulations on this movie and everything you've got going on. I love, I love everything that you're doing. I'm so happy for you. It's great to see you. It's so great to see you. Family. Thank you. Yes, I'm so welcome. lucky to be here. It's so good to see you guys. Okay, we can uh, look forward to Holiday for Heroes is premiering over the holidays on Hallmark Movies and Mysteries. And of course, The Young and the Restless airs every weekday. Check it out, everybody. She's I awesome. I can't wait to see who you're going to end up with. I know, me too. <laughs> you, too. you don't even know. Hello.